Did you know that where the Netherlands stands today, a giant sea monster once reigned supreme? Let's rewind the clock about 75 million years back to the late Cretaceous period. Forget windmills and tulip fields. Picture a vast, warm, shallow sea covering most of Europe. This ancient ocean was a bustling metropolis of marine life, and at the very top of the food chain was a creature straight out of a nightmare: the mighty Mosasaurus Huffmanni. This wasn't just any sea lizard. Mosasaurus was an absolute giant, a true apex predator. Imagine a creature stretching up to 17 meters or 56 feet in length. That's longer than a city bus. It was built for power, a true titan of the deep. Its body was streamlined and muscular, and instead of legs, it had powerful, paddle-like limbs that propelled it through the water with terrifying speed and agility. It navigated this prehistoric sea not just as a resident, but as its undisputed king. Now, let's talk about its most formidable weapon: its mouth. The Mosasaurus had double-hinged jaws similar to a snake's. This incredible adaptation allowed it to open its mouth incredibly wide, wide enough to swallow large prey whole. And inside those jaws were rows of sharp conical teeth designed for one thing: gripping and crushing. When those jaws snapped shut, they did so with immense force, ensuring that anything caught in their grasp had no chance of escape. Whether it was large fish, ammonites, or even other marine reptiles, if it was in the water. It was on the menu for Mosasaurus. The discovery of Mosasaurus fossils, particularly in the limestone quarries around Maastricht in the Netherlands, completely changed our understanding of prehistoric life. The very first remains found there in the late 18th century sparked a revolution in science, helping to lay the groundwork for the field of paleontology. So the next time you think of the Netherlands, remember the incredible history beneath its soil. A history of a lost ocean, ruled by one of the most powerful marine reptiles to have ever lived. Thanks for diving into the past with us. If you enjoyed this journey back in time, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more adventures into the prehistoric world. See you next time.